hi everyone welcome to my channel and yes thank you for subscribing thank you for watching thank you for just being here for me let's get into today's video -na 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 -na. okay so recently i went to retro africa to you know go enjoy a beautiful solo exhibition by a nigerian um artist based in um the uk apparently he is or used to be a civil engineer and then at some point art called him into and he decided to obey the call and so he made um he began making his own unique art i think what i found interesting about his um, piece or his collection was um how he infused the concept of stranger you know comes as a stranger in all of his art piece when i went there i had a lot of time to you know think about my life to think about a lot of things and realize how that in different times of my life i have infused you know a certain stranger into my life however this collection he had was not just about strangers but also it was about migration yes in those days uh you know blacks were taken as slaves and that now in our present time we still see people you know migrating and he's not talking about the fact that if you should if he's not talking about the fact that um, you shouldn't move to a better place if you find that wherever you're going to is a better place he's talking about the fact that people in those days were forced to leave their native lands to become slaves in other countries the, you know and security of some countries are now making people to again migrate and you know they're paying so much money with passion and with tears you know to leave their motherland to go to a better place so he, he just simply used his art to talk about this this political instability um economic crisis and a lot of those things his paintings were vivid had vivid colors they were very expressive and no matter what they had a way that you could read it from different perspectives i am going to go straight into showing you the different piece and there's, there's going to be a voice note just to give you an idea of what uh, i thought were the meaning of the different paintings and what i learned were the meaning and you know things i found interesting about the different art pieces and um, yes yeah, so the the next videos coming in um were shot in my phone and yes i wasn't allowed to use a camera in you know the exhibition hall you can't take pictures with the camera when you go to see uh, an exhibition artwork if you do that you are going to be charged a fee so i used my phone to record and take pictures just a bonus to it i also visited retro africa's um, restaurant just beside it and i had something light to eat it back and watch and enjoy and if you have any um questions comments just let me know what you think about you know um the paintings the artwork and general in general the video okay hi guys i'm heading over to retro africa to be to explore a solo exhibition by ken and what Diobu. The title, A Different Perspective, The Migrant and Different Shades of Eco. Um, professional. Um, he's an artist that plays with colors and simple forms. And um, he explores the concept of um, a stranger and migration. Some people want to live for the sake of a better tomorrow in the same boat our ancestors left as slave is one of like the strong key points in his exhibition. In a different perspective, he introduced the concept of strangers, which he infuses as the white and black charcoal paints. The stranger is always unknown, sometimes can be the third party in a long distance relationship, in a family, society, and in any religious crisis. The stranger is inflicted with the most pain. It's, it's quite sad, but that's very true. 
you know after observing this all i also found it quite interesting that when you go to see these paintings by the time you see the artwork on the wall there's already a concept that plays in your head however when um the, the curator begins telling you what he the um, artist had in mind when creating these art pieces you realize how deep his thoughts were and how that everyone can in one way or the other relate to his um his piece like uh, for example the one that talked about um a distant relationship how that um most times people never know when the line of communication is cut but as time goes on you realize one day that there is a space you know a very large gap between the two parties and then a, a third wheeler joins in it's just steep um he also explores some um self-inflicting internalized um paintings like um the lady who has to adapt to a new culture um um the concept of um uh, influencers the fact that influencers um sometimes are good sometimes are bad and that followers fail to pay attention to what the influencer may be um preaching before they follow also talked about the concept of um the lagos hustle we see a young man trying to jump you know trying to jump into his follow um one of the yellow vehicles because he has to hedge in then we also explore so this is part of the um exhibition i found quite interesting where you have like different faces in different boxes and um apparently some of the paintings are sold as nfts so one of the box goes as a complimentary complimentary gift to people that buy the nft um artwork finally i moved to retro africa to um explore its peaceful oh yeah to the restaurant to explore its peaceful greenery scenery and i loved it i ordered a strawberry ginger drink something something uh, <laughs> i can't remember the name it was a little bit sweet for me but but it was good please do and let me know how it went so yes thank you very much and i'll see you soon